The U.S. Embassy in Bahamas has issued a travel advisory cautioning against the visits to the island nation due to the surge in violence this winter. With 18 murders reported in January, largely linked to gang-related activities, concerns about tourist safety have escalated. The embassy has emphasized the severity of the situation and has advised against physically resisting robbery attempts. In an official release, the embassy stated, The U.S. Embassy in Nassau advises U.S. citizens to be aware that 18 murders have occurred in Nassau since the beginning of 2024. Murders have occurred at all hours, including in broad daylight on the streets. Retaliatory gang violence has been the primary motive for murders. And so, the travelers are urged to exercise extra caution when walking or driving at night, keeping a low profile, staying aware of the surroundings and refraining from resisting robbery attempts. The advisory also recommends reviewing and updating personal security plans in response to the heightened security concerns in the region. The Prime Minister of the Bahamas, Philip Davis, has also announced the measures to address the crisis, including roadblocks and covert police actions. Despite potential inconveniences, he emphasized the importance of making streets safer and reducing the impact of violent crimes on citizens' lives. The concerns extend beyond land-based activities, with officials expressing worries about unregulated water activities lacking adequate safety measures. The State Department has also noted that boaters have made risky choices and commercial boat operators sometimes operate irresponsibly regardless of weather forecasts resulting in injuries and fatalities. The travel advisory trends continue in the region as State Department recently raised its travel advisory for Jamaica 2 to level 3 out of 4 signaling a ring consider travel recommendation with do not travel being the only higher threat remaining. The advisory for Jamaica cited frequent occurrences of violent crimes including home invasions, armed robberies and sexual assaults and homicide with specific warning about sexual assault happening frequently even at an all-inclusive resort. For the unaware, the gang-related violence has skyrocketed in the Caribbean islands, predominantly due to the crisis in Haiti. And so, the travel advisories are becoming more and more common for the nations.